The proposal to transform an old hospital in Lancaster into a housing office and retail complex is being met with mixed emotions. Last week, we reported UPMC has been the buyer for the old St. Joseph's Hospital, but the sale could depend on how the community feels about what it could become. Andrew Forgotch is live in Lancaster with more. Andrew. Well, Val and Alicia, right now, the plan for the old St. Joseph Hospital here in Lancaster it includes adding more than 300 adult seniors. And some argue that's what the city needs, while others say it just promotes gentrification. The old St. Joseph's Hospital on College Avenue is vacant. Tammy Rojas, who lives around the corner from it, worries about what it could become. Here they are continuing with this agenda of putting in housing without addressing what, we're, what we've also lost and how that affected the communities. Rojas, an anti-poverty activist, is begging the city to reject the UPMC's proposal to rezone the old hospital lot, saying what it would do is push your neighbors out. The nearby property is, you know, fixed up and redeveloped. The property values rise, so therefore rents rise. And or uh, landlords sell off the property, which then, you know, it gets flipped, and then those people are evicted out because they want different tenants. Initial plans for development include adding 325 housing units. A little less than half, or 120 of them, would be affordable to people with low and moderate incomes. The mayor of Lancaster said that's a win for families whose income has not kept up with the cost of housing. For the project to move forward, a rezoning proposal needs to be approved by Lancaster City Council. I think that uh, gentrification is a very real concern and that both the city and county government uh, need to take more seriously uh, our obligation to ensure that people uh, can get into and secure safe and affordable housing. City Council President Ishmael smith Waydell has also championed the need for affordable housing. So he said he'll face a tough decision when deciding if the rezoning should be allowed. It will be a question of how secure are we that the affordable housing will actually materialize and, and what will be the effect uh, on the community at large? The City Council will hear that zoning proposal next Monday. In Lancaster, I'm Andrew Fordash, ABC 27 News. Thank you, Andrew. Still ahead on ABC 27.